Hey everyone, welcome back to the Visually Stunning Movie Podcast. Mark here. Thank you for listening. Hey, it's uh, it's still Valentine's Day weekend here and now, uh, and so I've got another romantic comedy for you very quickly. Um, this is uh, from the directing duo of Naomi McDougal Jones and Meredith Edwards, um, and it is called Bite Me. And it is the story of a vampire named Sarah who uh, gets audited by the IRS because she hasn't filed taxes in years because she is a member of a church uh, of vampirism, uh, which becomes the crux of the IRS audit. Now she's getting audited by James, a kind of lackluster IRS agent who uh, is really trying to wrap his head around this whole Europe vampire. Now, first off, these are not vampires. Um, These are like people in the real world who have built a community around the vampire lifestyle and the drinking voluntary of blood, human blood. Um, And this is the vampiric world in which James finds himself dealing with Sarah, a vampire, uh, and Sarah dealing with James and how that all shakes out. Now, yes, that makes it a romantic comedy because, of course, the meat cute is anyone and their IRS auditor. Now, um... Uh, there are parallels to any marginalized society that you would like to put here um, and replace with vampire. The queer parallels are incredibly obvious, so we don't have to harp on those parallels. Understand that in this movie, vampire is other. Any other group, whether it be racial, whether it be gender, whether it be sex, it doesn't matter the other. Now, the questions that this film asks are important. And those questions are, um, what are you? And I know that sounds simple, but the answer is never, I am X. Nobody is X. Everyone is A, D, F, Q, Y, W, C, Nobody is one thing. So this film is Sarah trying to figure out how to be a vampire and love a normal person uh, without sacrificing those things that she thinks are her identity about the vampire lifestyle. So there are deep issues going on here. Uh, that that everyone discusses you know if you enter into a relationship are you sacrificing your individuality to another person if you are in a considered a member of a group does the group define you or does the group is the group merely one aspect of who you are again lots of really good questions being asked here and Ultimately, a lot of those questions are answered by the time we get to the end of the film. Uh, the, the film uh, stars Naomi McDougal Jones as Sarah. Uh, Christian Coulson is James. Naomi Grossman is uh, Sarah's friend uh, and the titular head of their sect of vampirism that is being audited. Now, <laughs> she is so great. Uh, in this and I don't want to downplay anyone else's performances because a film like this only works if everyone is like I'm in and you're going to both play it straight and for the laughs that are inherent in the situations and the characters and I think really everyone kind of does that here in Bite Me Uh, they, they, they embrace the concept and they just go with it. No one is playing super over the top unless that character is in fact uh, 
kind of over the top. And, and I, I think that's a wonderful balance to, to strike a lot of big films. Can't pull that off. A lot of little films always go for, for melodrama drama or, you know, way over the top stuff. I like the balance that bite me finds. I, I, I think, uh, Jones and Edwards, our directors, uh, have done a really good job in getting that out of their cast. So, um, it's, it's a really surprising rom-com in that it's not just, can you love someone? It's, but it's like, what do you love them for? What do you give up to love them? And again, it's just, it's a lot of wonderful questions that we get examples of a lot of good answers by the end of the film. So that is bite me. Um, it, you, it, it's out. You can, uh, download it digitally, pick an outlet. You can probably find it. Um, I, I, I really did enjoy it. This was the third rom-com I watched this week because it was the week before Valentine's day. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Check it out. Uh, we'll be back soon. Ryan will be back. We have some big releases coming. Uncharted is coming. The Batman is coming. Uh, Channing Tatum's new film Dog is coming. Uh, we we have big films coming, and it is a blast to be, be back. Um, if you haven't been back to the theaters yet, pick a movie and go see one in the theaters. You will remember what you are missing by watching it on even your biggest screen at home. Trust me. So till then, don't forget to like us, follow us on social media, you know, Facebook and Twitter. We are at VS Movie Podcast. If you're on YouTube, uh, just look up Visually Stunning Movie Podcast and you can watch my mug talk about these films for you. But subscribe there. That would also be really helpful. Um, and let us know what you think. Give us some feedback. You know, let us know what works, which doesn't, what doesn't for you. Let us know what you wish we do more of. Uh, maybe we can get around to doing some more of that. So till next time. Take it easy. Stay safe. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.